A technology promising to be a game changer for the farming industry and beyond, growing crops faster using less energy, and it's being developed right here in New Mexico. News 13's Michaela DePauli has details. A process taking light from the sun and making it more powerful. It's a technology called quantum dots. Tiny nanoparticles used to manufacture greenhouse glass and solar panels that actually manipulate the light spectrum, boosting the amount of energy ordinary sunlight can produce with zero added power use. It's really about making food and energy production more efficient. In the case of the greenhouse product, we can get up to a 30 to 40 percent yield improvement. Los Alamos based Ubiquity has been at the forefront of the industry now selling products that use a new generation of quantum dots that are more durable and safe to be around food sources. An innovation that founder Hunter McDaniel helped develop when he worked at Los Alamos National Lab. That was really the founding idea. Quantum dots can now become ubiquitous, in other words, literally everywhere, because we've addressed these fundamental challenges around toxicity, cost, and durability. This year, the company secured major financial backing to the tune of $26 million from venture capitalist investments and Silicon Valley Bank financing. I think this is really an opportunity for to create an economic engine around the energy transition. Um, you know, this technology is really advanced in terms of um, being able to benefit um, these markets. Now, McDaniel says they're gearing up to scale production 20 times by next year. Research and development experts say companies like Ubiquity are helping lead the push to bring cutting edge tech into the private sector. It's, it's a natural place where, where, where these types of industries should emerge and, and should be supported. Fostering jobs ranging from entry level to skilled technicians and PhDs. So that as these companies start to get formed and, and start to become very successful, like Ubiquity has become right now, that when they employ people, uh, they seek New Mexicans and there are New Mexicans available to take these types of jobs. Michaela DePauli, KRQE News 13. And Ubiquity's founder says the state has been a major player in making their expansion possible with the State Investment Council supporting venture capitalists and the Economic Development Department supporting employees with its job training incentive program.